everyone, it's Tammy and I have a little haul here from that Smell Good shop. And it's some wax that I needed. <laughs> okay, maybe not entirely needed, but wanted. Yay, and I got 13 little items. Thanks a bunch. Happy, sni happy sniffing. That's cute. Okay, so... I guess I can make you guys face me so that it won't be since I'm sniffing. <laughs> Let me get my tripod. Oh no, I just lost my calendar. Oh good. Okay, so hold on just a second. Okay, so we're back. And so I got lots of these little, I think they're two ounce, oh no, they're 0.8 ounce little smell good shop. And it's thatsmellgoodshop.com. So this first one is Fireside. Oh, it smells wonderful. It smells as though it's on a fireside. It smells really good. And then I have Hearth and Home. Oh, that smells like fall. Oh, it smells wonderful. Gosh, these are great. And I think I've ordered from her before. I'm not positive. This one is Caramel Macchiato. Oh, it's very caramely. Just a little hint of... Um, coffee. That is really nice. Gosh, I so far, honestly, those three are amazing. Pumpkin spice, I can only imagine. Oh. This is really good, guys. I am not even kidding. If you are thinking of getting some more wax or some max wax melts, this might be a place for you to try. Pumpkin bites. <laughs> Very similar to the pumpkin spice, very good. Just very pumpkin-y. Um, almond, I love that smell, so. Yes, it smells just like almond extract. Oh. Butter cookie. Oh my goodness, I want to eat this. Oh my gosh, it smells so good, it smells just like shortbread, oh. Um, this one is Sinistrudel, so it's like cinnamon strudel, I guess. Yes, it smells like a cinnamon bun or a cinnamon roll. Oh my gosh, these are amazing, guys. I'm not even kidding. Grapeity grape. Oh, so good. It smells like grape, and I love the scent of grape. This is so bizarre. I am like dying here. Patchouli vanilla. I've... It smells like patchouli and vanilla. And I like the smell of patchouli. I was born in the 70s, so maybe that's why. I don't know, but I like the smell of it. Bewitched. That one smells fall-like. I was expecting it to smell... I don't know. It is kind of a little bit like I was expecting. Like something in the cauldron, I guess because it said bewitched. Um, and this might be something that you would expect to smell in the cauldron. It's kind of earthy, um, very fall, leafy. It smells good though. Warm vanilla nutmeg. Oh. Oh my gosh. Mm. Makes me think of a nice warm drink. Mmm, I have my coffee here, but I want to put some of that in it. And this one is Lattes by the Fire. Oh, that sounds good. Wow, that is really good. Gosh, this one smells a lot more like coffee, like a latte. 
with a little bit of this fireside scent that I smelled first. Oh my goodness, I really am not kidding guys. These are amazing. It did take a little bit of time to ship, but it wasn't too awfully horrible. Um, and these are small, and I think that they were $1.75 a piece, so they weren't very much money either, but they're small. And I'm sure that they will last a day in my melt. I have a timer on my melter, and it goes three, six, or nine hours, and I usually always put them on nine, especially if I'm going to be in here all day. And uh, I'm sure that this scent, because it's strong enough that it'll definitely last the nine hours. There are some of the homemade melts that I can make last two, sometimes even three um, days, like nine hours. Sometimes I guess I don't get a full nine hours out of them the second or third day. But um, these might even be those because, or might be some that do that because the scent is very nice and strong. There's not a weak scent in the bunch and they're all really good. It's not overpowering or anything. So I'm gonna leave her link for her store below, but it's that smell good shop. Dot com and they are just amazing. Oh, I'm looking forward to melting them. I want to melt them all at the same time. <laughs> that would be a mess, wouldn't it? Oh, lovely. So there you go. Thanks so much, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.